Hello everybody, Remroff here. I just thought I uh, made a video while I am uh, finishing this drawing. Um, uh, the only thing I have to do is just um, a bit more uh, of the backgrounds. And I've been working on this drawing uh, since I'm back from the Netherlands. Um, if you see my uh, previous uh, videos, um, you know I'm, I was visiting my family in the Netherlands, and I um, I was kind of stuck there because I was traveling with a um, expired Canadian permanent residence card, so I couldn't get back into. Canada with um, with that one, and I had to apply for a permanent resident travel document to get back into the country again. So um, initially, um, my trip was planned for three weeks, and I ended up staying there for six weeks, which was um, it was also nice because I had more time to spend uh, with my mom and to see everybody um, uh, who I wanted to see so um, yeah that was a good thing I'm also uh, happy to be back again to be uh, back to my drawing and to be back home again it's just um, nice as well um, before I uh, left for the Netherlands uh, I uh, already started with this drawing um, the only thing I had finished was uh, the eye and a bit around it. So since February 8th, since I'm back again in the country, um, I've uh, finished the rest. I've been drawing about uh, in between 5 to 8 hours. Which is, um, yeah, which is nice, I love drawing. Um, time goes extremely fast when I'm working on a drawing. Um, I love to focus on all the tiny little details of the fur and this pillow that he's sitting on and I had a lot of fun with it and then the time just goes really fast and when I'm working on a, on a drawing like this I just um, I'm just focusing so much on it and I, uh, I even uh, every now and then I even forget to eat and drink the whole day which is of course not all that healthy but it happens every now and then I don't even notice that I'm getting thirsty or anything it's kind of funny actually um, while I was uh, in the Netherlands, um, some friends uh, came to my apartment and they searched for my valid permanent resident card because I knew I received it in 2018. I applied for it and uh, I remembered getting the letter and um, without realizing, I mean, constantly carrying around my um, old permanent resident card that wasn't valid anymore. So, um, some friends searched my whole apartment, through my whole apartment for it, and uh, they couldn't find it, so I thought I, uh, I must have uh, accidentally destroyed it, because they did find the letter, and the letter said, told me to destroy the old one, and I thought that, oh, I must have accidentally destroyed the, um, the new one instead, and carrying around the old one without realizing the whole time. But when, uh, when I came back, uh, the day, right the day after, I searched through my old apartments again and, and I cleaned everything up because everything was a bit um, chaotic here and, um, and disorganized. So I thought I'm just going to clean everything up and tidy everything up and uh, who knows, maybe I'll find it. And miraculously, I did find it in a backpack, in a really small backpack that I wasn't using anymore. I was using it for uh, work in um, 2018, so uh, I'm very happy I found it, so I don't have to apply for a new permanent resident card, because um, 
if there's something I find stressful and something I really hate is red tape and filling out forms and applying for things and um, so I'm happy that I don't have to uh, go through that. I think um, the focusing on these details of a drawing and being able to focus on it for so many hours in a row, I think it's also uh, autism related. I, um, I always love focusing on details and the longer I look, the more details I see. And um, yeah, it's, um, it's kind of part of being autistic as well. Just the uh, ability to focus on such small details and to even notice all the small details. People have often asked me how I create the background so smooth, and but this is how I do it. I it create many layers over each other. I don't even apply much pressure. I let the weight of the pencil do everything. And that way you can just create um, a colored surface that is... Um, smooth and equal and you don't see the individual strokes so this drawing is almost finished I'm gonna keep on uh, working a bit on it until I'm um, completely satisfied with it thank you very much for watching and um, I hope to see you with my next videos again. Bye!